I'm Truck Shell Camping at Lake Norman State Park, located on Lake Norman in North Carolina. Well, this is my campsite. This campground is actually considered to be primitive type camping only because there aren't any electrical or water hookups at the campsites. But rumor has it that in the near future they are going to expand this campground and add a loop with full hookups. The campsites are actually pretty nice. They all have a picnic table, a fire ring, a lantern pole and a tent pad. There are some campsites on around the loop from where I'm camping that actually have a nice view of the lake and there's also a clean shower house and restroom located in the middle of the campground. This campground is extra nice in the summertime, especially if you have a boat or a water ski or something to bring camping with you. There's a boat dock right around the corner from the campground. Now, we are still technically in the winter season, although it's been really mild here this winter, and we only have a week or so before spring starts. But I don't think you're going to be seeing anyone skiing or getting too wet down there in the lake. There are probably going to be some fishing boats, maybe some kayaks and canoes. There are a few hiking trails here. One of the reasons I'm camping here is because of the bike trails. There are some really nice bike trails located in the park and a lot of people um, come here just for the trails. So I'm going to get camp set up and go check out some of the bike trails. I pretty much have most of the camp set up. I'm going to go ahead and jump on the bike and ride down and check out some of these trails. Mambo Loop. Difficulty rating easy. That sounds like a good one to start on.
Well, that was pretty fun. Those were some nice bike trails. I just did the two easier loops. I wanted to work out, and I can say mission accomplished, and then some. So, luckily I, bought, I brought some ibuprofen with me, because I'm going to feel this in the morning, I'm sure. So, I'm going to wind things down a little bit, get something to eat, and kick back and relax. Well, I just got back from the shower house and the lights inside the shower house slash bathroom are activated by motion. So if there's no motion detected after a period of time, the lights will go out. Well, when I first got in the shower, I had to wait two or three minutes for the water to warm up. It was like ice cold and eventually it got really hot, but about halfway through my shower, all of the lights went out, so I ended up having to take a shower in the dark. And as soon as I stepped out of the shower, everything came back on again. I'm wondering if tonight's going to be a movie night. I've got this DVD player hooked up to the ammo can battery box, as well as a USB fan. I'm going to run this fan just for some air movement and white noise. So. I brought a few DVDs here to pick from, and I'm probably going to check out one of these movies. Call it a night. I'll check back in in the morning. Weather, man. Looks like it's going to be another beautiful day today. The weather's just perfect. I thought I was going to wake up sore from that bike riding, but I actually feel pretty good. Good enough to go check out another bike trail. So, thanks for watching the video, and I'll see you soon.